Hello my travelers and welcome back to another vlog, Let's Travel Colombia, Jonathan here as always and today we start a new trip, a new adventure and I'm super excited about it because we're going to Victoria Caldas. This is a place that I don't know personally but I have heard so many good things and these few days are going to be super super nice. So let's go to the trip then. Okay, my travelers, so we arrived to Victoria Caldas. I'm super excited as I was telling you. And the first thing that you're gonna find is this advice thing that you can see right in the middle of the park with all the information about Victoria Caldas. So we are going to the hotel right now and then we're gonna start the activities. I'm gonna show you everything that you need to know about this place. Victoria is a municipality of Caldas located on the east of the department, just four hours from Manizales and Bogotá, five hours from Medellín and three hours from Ibagué. It also enjoys sunny days with an average temperature of 31 degrees Celsius or 88 Fahrenheit. Something that you cannot help but see is the incredible tall ceiba tree right in the middle of the main plaza. Some people say that it has over 130 years and others that it's actually over 200 years old. One thing is for sure, it's an imposing and beautiful tree. Okay, my travelers, and we arrived to our hotel, Eco Hotel Balmoral, in about 10 minutes from Victoria's main plaza. And this is a true paradise, my travelers. Look at this. I'm gonna show you in a lot more depth about this hotel, but what I can tell you so far is that it's incredible. You hear the birds, you see, uh, you have the pool very close by, and the first thing that you get when you arrive is a little cocktail to refresh yourself because of the, um, of the heat. So this is pretty amazing. I'm very happy to be here.
Okay, my travelers, let me just show you the pool because the pool, it's pretty amazing. And as you know me, of course, I'm gonna jump to it. So let's see the pool. So it's pretty big and it has like this infinity edge as you can call it with a pretty nice view but it has also some chairs that you can sit on without getting all wet and it looks really really nice with the sound of the birds and that beautiful sunset is what you can enjoy here. All right, my travelers, so we are here with Jairo Andres Vargas, which is going to tell us a little bit of the history of Victoria and some of the most representative things that you can find here. Hola, viajeros. Bueno, estamos en Victoria. Victoria es un municipio fruto de la colonización antioqueña. La última fundación fue en 1879, es decir, hace 141 años. Se dice que varios conquistadores españoles recorrieron esta región y eh, fundaron un poblado. Sin embargo, eh, ese poblado tuvo que trasladarse varias veces hasta que se perdió el rastro en la historia. Ese poblado de mediados del siglo XIX está ubicado en la Cuchilla de Bellavista. Se dice que esta aldea, que en ese tiempo pertenecía al departamento del Tolima, en este territorio era eh, muy tormentoso, había bastantes eh, tempestades y tenían problemas con el agua. Por lo tanto, decidieron trasladarse al sitio en el que estamos en la actualidad el 23 de diciembre de 1879, como les cuento. La herencia histórica de Victoria y precisamente la ubicación geográfica hacen que los victorianos sean de tradición paisa, pero al mismo tiempo estén bastante influenciados por el departamento del Tolima e incluso por migraciones que han venido desde los departamentos de Cundinamarca, Boyacá o Los Santanderes. Existen muchas maneras del ser victoriano y esto eh, está en el borde entre la cordillera y el Valle del Magdalena. Por lo tanto, es una mezcla grande de culturas. Arepa rellena. Looks very tasty. Let's try it. It's really good, just like I like it. Okay, my travelers, so we finished day one in Victoria, Caldas, Colombia. Today we didn't have as many activities because actually the adventure starts tomorrow, going down to the river and doing many other things that you will see. But today was more like traveling, getting to see the place around, and that was pretty much it, staying here in the hotel, Eco Hotel Balmoral, which is super recommended for you guys and I'm gonna link everything so you can visit them and if you want to come, you can send us a message. So let's make the bed test and I will see you tomorrow. And that's where we're gonna leave this video, my travelers, as there is a lot more to see in Victoria, but you will have to wait until next week. And I promise you won't be disappointed. We did many adventurous things and we saw some incredible stuff, so stay tuned for that one. And in the meantime, remember to follow us on our social media, Facebook, Instagram, subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit the like button if you like this video, and leave us your comments if you want to visit Victoria. Also remember that you can send us a message so we can arrange a trip for you to Victoria Caldas. Until the next one, my travelers, thank you for watching.